Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new video. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. In today's video, we're going to be discussing some awesome news that we received over the past couple of days, and that is about a brand new patent that was filed by Rockstar that is for a next generation AI system for NPCs inside video games and especially GTA 6. Now, NPCs in video games, and especially open world games, are extremely important because if you do not have good AI and you don't have good NPCs, the game is simply going to feel unrealistic and it is not going to be to the best of its ability. So today we're going to be discussing what exactly this patent means and what it contains and how it is going to pertain in regards to GTA 6. So we're going to be discussing a ton of really awesome information inside this video, and we're going to be getting into that in just a quick minute here. But first off, if you haven't already, be sure to drop a like rating on this video to show your support, as well as subscribe down below for more daily videos just like this. But first off, here is today's shout out of the day, and Rafat went to the actual video. So today's shout out of the day goes to a really awesome music producer known as Lucas Barrick. Now Lucas has been producing music all the way from 2008 and he specializes in making really awesome beats, instrumental tracks, and also everything in between. He always has something new in the works, so if you are interested in beats, instrumentals, and all of that good stuff, make sure to go ahead and click the first link in the description down below to subscribe to his channel on YouTube and stay tuned for new music just around the corner. But with that being said, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into this video. So with GTA 5 being an open world game, Rockstar spent a lot of time developing enemy and also NPC AI to make it as realistic as possible and also to provide a fluid experience. Now compared to some newer titles, including Red Dead Redemption 2 and other games developed by other game companies, GTA 5's AI definitely seems a little bit aging, and with Rockstar working on GTA 6 actively at the moment, they did publish a patent publicly that does contain a number of elements surrounding a brand new NPC system that is dedicated on AI. So one of the biggest changes that is going to be coming with this brand new system is how the NPCs are able to interact and also traverse the environment. In regards to how vehicles are driving around the map, if you take a look at GTA 5, all of the vehicles in the game are locked onto a specific grid and they are almost like on rails driving down that path. Now GTA 5 does have a little bit of AI in some parts of the game. For example, if you do ram a car off of the road, it does manage in some cases to get back on that road and continue that path. It really depends on the situation and it isn't the best. Sometimes the NPCs just get out of the car and start running. It is a little bit hit or miss, but it is there. However, it is not at its full extent. Now with this new system that Rockstar is allegedly going to be implementing into GTA 6, those rails and grids are going to be completely gone, so all NPCs and characters inside the game are able to drive freely using 100% AI technology. To my knowledge, this hasn't really been done inside a video game at least at a massive scale so far. All open world games, again including GTA 5 and even games like Red Dead Redemption 2, all have a grid system where all NPCs are locked onto a specific path and they don't really have their own sense of urgency to go anywhere else outside it. Now besides driving, this also is very similar for NPCs that are just walking around the map. With other games, those NPCs are locked onto a specific path and here they're going to be able to walk freely around the map in designated areas. So what this means to the end user is first and foremost, the game is going to be a lot more realistic when you are playing in free roam. By going around the map and seeing characters and NPCs traverse the map in their own ways and without being stuck onto a specific lane on the highway and going around the entire map, it is going to make things a lot more realistic and also bumping into other people, going around crowds is also going to be a lot more realistic because Rockstar is going to be able to leverage this new technology. 
If you have been following my channel for a while now, you would know that we have discussed already numerous times that Rockstar is likely going to be implementing new NPC tech into the game, and finally we do have some official confirmation. Now if you want to see the official patent for yourself, I will leave a link to an article in the description down below that you can go ahead and check out. The patent doesn't really reveal that much information itself besides what we're already discussing in this video. But the official patent is titled System and method for virtual navigation in a gaming environment, and it is aimed at creating a realistic experience in video games by making AI smarter by detecting the environment. Specifically, the patent is targeting NPC vehicle driving behaviors. So I think it is pretty much 100% confirmed that this is in fact for GTA 6. On top of that, Rockstar has been hiring quite a bit for a lot of AI roles internally at Rockstar to develop this new system. So all of those pieces are coming together and this is going to be a big driving factor for GTA 6 and everything it has to do in regards to NPCs and how they interact with the world. So we're likely not going to be seeing this in action anytime soon. When Rockstar usually reveals a game, they usually do reveal it with a very light trailer showcasing the environment, which is likely not going to show this new AI system. However, as we do get closer to the launch of GTA 6, Rockstar is definitely going to make this a talking point for the game. It seems like they have been working quite a while on this, and if they implement it correctly, which I'm sure they're going to do, it is truly going to set a new level for AI and NPCs inside open world games going forward. But let me know what your thoughts are about this in those comments down below. Do you think the AI and NPCs inside GTA 5 can be improved? And also, do you support this idea of adding a new type of NPC AI that will allow them to roam freely around the map instead of just being locked onto rails? Let me know what your thoughts are in those comments down below, as well as any other wishlist items you have for GTA 6, because I really want to hear from you guys. But either way, that is pretty much going to wrap it up for today's video. If you enjoyed watching this video, let me know by dropping a like rating, as well as subscribe down below if you haven't already with those bell notifications on, so you're always notified whenever I upload a brand new video. Thank you again for tuning in today, I really do appreciate it, and I'll see you tomorrow when we take another video just like this. But until then, have an awesome day, and I'll be sure to talk to you guys then.